Well, hey there, folks. How are you? Lovely to see you again as usual. And thank you very much for popping over just to see what I got in this month's snack surprise box. So, yeah, I got this a couple of days ago, but I just have not had the time to unbox it. So that's me unboxing it now. So if you're new and this is your first time here, welcome to you as well. My name's Cheryl. This is What's For Tea and this is my monthly snack surprise unboxing for the month of January. And thank you very much to the guys over at Snack Surprise for sending us these boxes every month for free just to review and open and show you and tell you how it works. So I'm going to take the next couple of minutes just explaining how the subscription service works because it is a monthly subscription. So if you've heard it all before, feel free to skip forward a couple of minutes just to get into the box if you're just curious to see what I got this month. So yeah, let me explain a wee bit more about how it works. If you've heard all about Snack Surprise and you know how it works, feel free to skip forward a couple of minutes. So this is just for the folk that don't know anything about it. Snack Surprise is a monthly subscription box. It's a kind of snack discovery. And the thing I like about it is, you know, it's a different country every month and you don't know what country you're going to get until it arrives on your doorstep. But you're not tied into any sort of contract or anything like that. You can cancel whenever you like. They've got three different tiers of boxes. They have the mini box, which will contain at least five snacks and that will cost you £6.99. They have the original box which will contain at least 10 snacks and that's £12.99 per month. Or they've got the biggie which is the premium box and the one I've got to show you is 20 plus snacks and that will cost you £24.99. And that does include postage. All of your boxes include postage within the UK. They do ship to certain other countries and all of this information can be found on their website just go to the frequently asked questions section and it'll tell you all you know all about the shipping there if your country is not listed you know just give them an email because i think they do come and go with you you know depending on where you are we think it's a fab wee box and we love opening these boxes and seeing what they're sending us this month so that was just a wee bit about the box. As I said, the prices that I've just given you there, if you want to save 15% off of your first box, you'll find my discount code in the description box underneath and a link to the website. And it's just what's for T15. If you just enter that at checkout, you will automatically get 15% off whatever box you decide to go for. These boxes are absolutely jam-packed. And don't forget, you know, your shipping is included in the cost of your box. And I just do not know how they do it when you see the amount of snacks that you've got. So let me go and show you what's in this month's. So as you can see, this month we have Bulgaria and inside your box you will always get an information card and in there you'll find all of your product information, giving you, you know, details about each individual item that's in your box, as well as the contents of your mini box, the original box and the premium box. If you go for the premium box, you'll get all of the snacks contained in this leaflet. Your mini box this month has six your original box has an additional six and these additional products if you choose to go for the premium box. So in total, you will have 23 snacks should you wish to go for the box that I've got. And like I say, I am sent the premium box. So the first thing I pulled out was this wheat cake. Now, I think cakes must be quite popular. This is a cream filled uh, sponge cake. And then we've got some crisps. So these are paprika flavoured crisps and we do get this kind of thing over here and I'm a big fan of paprika crisps. Next out of the box we've got some more crisps but these are a sort of lighter corn puff type snacks and they're, they're flavoured with dill and cream cheese so they look interesting and a massive big bags and I forgot to say that as well all of the snacks contained in your box will all be full size or sort of sharing size packs so that's fab. Next out of the box, we've got some bruschetta. And these ones, there, there are two options in, that you might get in your box. The ones I have are the grilled vegetable variety. I think there's a mushroom variety as well. And these are just a nice wee crunchy snack, I think, especially for on the go. The next thing out of the box, I've never seen anything like this before. And it's basically a wafer sandwich. And it's this vibrant pink colour. And inside, it's actually filled with Turkish delight. So how about that? I mean, I love Turkish delight, but I've never actually seen it combined with wafer. So that or wafer, <laughs> depending on how you say it. So that's going to be super interesting to try. 
Next out of the box was another cake. Now this one is a chocolate cake and it's got three layers and sandwiched in between the layers is a sort of a creamy white cream type filling. So another one for the snack drawer. Next day at the box we've got another cake. Now this is a honey cake and it's covered in chocolate. So I was quite intrigued by this one so I did pop it open just to let you see. And as you can see it is just a round disc of cake flavoured with honey and covered in chocolate. And next out of the box was a rather fancy looking box of chocolates and I think I've read the description and I think it's basically like a fudge and there's wee sort of crispy wafery pieces in there as well and covered in chocolate and you will find this in your premium box should you decide to go for that and I think this would make a lovely gift actually you know just the way it's wrapped up there so yeah super chuffed to have this. Out of the box next were some pretzel bites or pretzels and these ones are coated in honey which I think are going to be super lovely and <laughs> super Moorish probably as well. Out of the box next were some pizza crackers and you will find these in your mini box. So they're just your sort of typical crackers with a nice pizza flavouring. So think cheese and tomato and that kind of thing. So yep, another one for the snack drawer. Another wee cake product next and this one is a vanilla cake and it's filled with a sort of cheesecake type filling. So in there you've got cream cheese and you've also got some fruit and again I think there are a couple of different varieties of this that you might get. In every box you will receive a drink if you go for the original box or the premium drink. You won't get a drink in the mini one but the drink this month is a sort of honey flavoured sparkling drink. Next out of the box, something I'm going to love, and these are violet flavoured hard candies. In this country, we have something called Parma Violets, but they're a sort of crunchier, softer sweet. These ones are hard boiled, and I do love the flavour of violet. So these are going to be a nice car sweetie for driving. Out of the box next, I think every country has their own version of these. They, they're calling them beer nuts, but they are peanuts with a nice crunchy coating on the outside. Again, incredibly Moorish and very naughty. Out of the box next were some beautiful looking caramels. Now these are obviously very popular in the country according to my information card and who doesn't like a caramel and these ones are meant to be ultra rich and creamy. Out of the box next we have a wafer bar. So this is chocolate wafer again sandwiched with that popular sort of white fondant filling. So another one for the snack drawer and we do like getting these kinds of things. Up next we have another bar and this is just a sort of typical chocolate nougat bar covered again <laughs> in milk chocolate. So another fab one for the snack drawer. Another bar next and we've got a peanut and waver bar covered in chocolate. I think waver must be quite popular in Bulgaria but yep another one for the snack drawer. And your final bar this month we've got another waver and chocolate bar but this time it's chocolate orange and who doesn't love chocolate orange it's certainly one of my favourites and another for the snack drawer which is getting quite full. And then we've got a wee cake bar. So this is a vanilla sponge cake with chocolate sandwiched through the middle and all covered in milk chocolate. And as it suggests there, it'd probably be perfect for a cup of coffee. Out of the box next was an absolutely massive box of biscuits. Apparently these are traditional and very popular in Bulgaria and they are a sort of chocolate orange ring shaped biscuit and there are going to be quite a few in this box I imagine because like I said it is a massive box and another one that I think might be very nice you know for a gift especially around about New Year, Christmas, that type of thing. Sadly we've just gone by that so we will be having these ourselves and I'll pop these into the biscuit drawer along with everything else so yep fab out of the box next we've got some aerated chocolate this is white chocolate and in this country we've got something called aero and i'm guessing it's just going to be uh, well exactly the same as that i don't think i've ever seen a white aero though but obviously we do get mint and orange and that kind of thing so yeah another one for the snack drawer out of the box next and I was rather intrigued by this. I'm saying what is this? And apparently it's a very traditional sort of um, dessert site type chocolate and it is just fondant covered with chocolate and it tastes a bit like in this country we have fries chocolate cream and it's a very delicate flavour but yeah nice to try. So that was our box for the month of January. Like I said that is the premium box but if that's way too many snacks for you because there are 23 snacks there they do 
do the original box, which has got, you know, less, and then your mini box, which is contains six snacks. So do let me know what you thought of this month's box and whether you do get this yourself or thinking about getting it. But just before I move on, a big thank you as usual to the supporters of the channel over on my Patreon page and to the new channel members as well. You know, thank you once again. It does mean ever so much. And thank you all for watching and liking and deciding to subscribe and leaving all your lovely comments. And some of you even share my videos, would you believe? I'm always super chuffed to see that. So until I see you again, which is going to be during the week for another wee recipe. And this week I'm doing the clouty dumpling. You know, I've been asked to do it so many times. So I'm going to show you how it is done. And then I'll be back for my shopping haul. And then of course, meet meals of the week on Sunday. So whenever you choose to join me again, guys, mind to have a brilliant rest of your week. Good rest of your day. Take care and bye for now. Bye now.